Peter, if you could just, first of all, just kind of take us through this week where you were preparing for this game, obviously second game time decision, but just what was it like for you preparing and when did you find out that you'd be starting tonight? Um, like Coach said, it was a game time decision. Um, I think we both were getting a lot of reps. Um, I think we both did good in practice. Um, like I said, it was, it was a game time decision, so. Was it tougher this week knowing that, hey, there could be a chance? Or kind of how, what was your approach just specifically to take us through this, knowing that there could be a chance? And how was that for you just preparing once? Um, nothing different. We still came to practice the same approach like we do every week. Um, like I said, it was a game time decision. Um, but nothing different, though. It, we still came came to battle. Um, that was that was about it. It was just game time game time decision. And I'm looking at you know the game today. Uh, a lot of opportunities for you to, to, to get some running with the RPO. I guess going into this week, how was you know learning the the, the playbook in terms of the package that you guys the game plan you guys are gonna have this Friday? Um, like Coach says, um, you know he keeps everyone ready for times like this. Um, Ones, the ones are going to be ready. Two is going to be ready. Three is going to be ready. So nothing different, really. Um, just I prepare the same way I do every week, really. And so you got to stay ready. Next man up. And just ones, the, like I said, the ones are ready. Two is ready. So it's every everyone's going to be, everyone's good. And, you know, um, another tough loss. I guess what was the message, you know, in the room, in the locker room from the coaching staff and from the veterans? You got to come harder next week. Just come harder next week, prepare better, watch more film, lift more weights, get stronger, faster, and just prepare better. How did it feel for you just did this be your first college start, really? I mean, it was, was the last time you started the game back in high school? Yes, sir. So how, how was this just kind of knowing, okay, I am going to start, so just kind of what was, was it nerves, was it confidence, what, what was it like overall? Um, first, I mean, I, I put my put my trust in God at first. Um, second, I just, I just trust my – Trust my training, really. Um, trust my coaching. Um, trust my O line, my team, and uh, that's what I did, really. And this one, I mean, you, you came in there because obviously you're hoping for a chance to probably play. So did it kind of besides just you know obviously you hand the ball off, but just like did it feel good just being out there and just being like, okay, I remember how to do this again. You still kind of felt like. Yes, sir. It felt it felt good. It felt good. To be back on the field, really. It's, it felt amazing. Were there any? Um, I guess nervous jitters involved going into this game for you. It was few, few uh, before the game. Like you said, I, I didn't take a snap uh, since high school, really, and um, <clears throat> it was a few before the game. I, I feel like if, if you're not nervous, a little little butterflies before the game, something's wrong. So um, it was it was a few, but since since I got that first snap, uh, it all went away. How tough was it? Just kind of you know, you obviously showed off your legs, you showed your arm, and you felt it. Just how tough was it against that defense to try to you know? Move the ball down the escape. It seemed like when we were ready to move after a while, they were just swarming on you. Uh, UCF, they, they 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 did good. They're a good team. Um, they played really good defense um, up front and the and coverages and everything like that. They, they did really good. Um, it was a tough opponent, but um, you got to come harder next week. Next week being being the bye week is just a matter of like you said, just putting the extra focus because SMU is coming in two weeks, and regardless if you were set for starting, I mean, it's just a matter of. And you said taking advantage of the, the bye week and staying ready? Yes, sir. Just, like I said, watching more film, getting more reps. Um, just come harder next week, really. Just train harder. Did, did you and Seth have any, have any conversations on the song? Did you try to, you know, keep your spirits up, not let you get you down after the interceptions or anything like that for your teammates? Did, or anything like that? Yes, sir. Yeah, my team, uh, they kept me They kept me going. They kept me positive throughout the whole drive. Seth did. Um, all the quarterbacks did. Um, my whole team did, really. And they kept me going. How key was that in the second half? Because obviously the, the three interceptions obviously could do a number on QB, but just how was how was the team just trying to keep their spirits lifted up and not letting you get too hard on yourself? Um, just they patted me on the back, um, just kept me going. Uh, they they try they put all their trust in me really, and um, they just really just kept me going, kept me alive. Terry, hey Peter, I know it's a disappointing game. Uh, other than interceptions, what positives can you take to this game so you can build on this and so you can get better going down the road? Um, it's a lot of positives, um, you know, in the run game, I think we did pretty good. RPOs, we did, I think we did good. Um, but we just got to get better um, all around, really. And it starts with me. Um, I, there's a lot of things that I, I did good and there's a lot of things I did bad and I, I can work on. So it starts with me. Um, 
with with you guys being out for more far obviously four games, but um Tyra said there's there's no different approach for these four games than before. But do you guys feel like right now things need to start changing a little bit more quickly because you guys are, are don't have as much time as say you didn't start this month? I think we just keep doing what we do, um playing Memphis football. Um like I said, we do have to go harder and uh watch more film, you know, lift more weights, things like that. But we're just gonna play Memphis football when it comes down to it. Should that mean you, know, you guys aren't worried at all at this point, or is it just kind of like you said, are you guys not worried at all? No, sir. We're, we're going to keep playing, doing what we do.